some Christians say that Hitler was an atheist, my immediate response is, well, God was a Christian and look how many people he killed. But also, there's no definitive proof that Hitler was an atheist, particularly not as he actually banned most atheist and freethought groups in Germany and said things about the Nazi party like, our movement is Christian. Unless Hitler was an undercover atheist. Which kind of sounds like a reality TV show, doesn't it? You know, where you send someone into the Catholic Church where they pretend to be a priest but they're actually an undercover atheist, and they hang out with the rest of the clergy who are also pretending to be priests but are actually undercover child molesters. And then you just sit back and see what fun, hilarity, and sexual abuse charges ensue. Like, oh. But also, even if Hitler had been an undercover atheist, you would still have the question as to why he felt he had to pretend to be religious. Was it that he knew he'd actually get more support from religious groups like the Catholic Church than he would from more secular groups? With the Vatican even going so far as to help Nazi war criminals escape Germany at the end of World War II? Though, you know, I guess, if you want to commit mass genocide and you're looking for something to back up those homicidal tendencies, you can't do much better than the Bible. So no, there is no proof that Hitler was an atheist. But also, if there is supposed to be a God from whom we get all of our morals, then why did that God just sit back and let Hitler kill millions of people? Though, to be fair, maybe the reason that God just ignored Hitler is that if you are a deity who has wiped out almost every creature on the face of the earth in a flood, then what Hitler was doing probably just seemed like the work of an absolute amateur. I'm just the son of a carpenter and I don't want anything from ya except for your eternal 